Welcome to ICT with Miss P and today we're going to look at ways that computers can share information and one of the ways they can do this is through a network. So a network simply is just a number of um, computers so maybe some desktop computers so here's a little picture of a desktop computer um, which this is a type of computer maybe a laptop my great picture of a laptop. Uh, maybe some smaller devices like iPads, tablet PCs, or um, maybe iPods or smartphones. And so maybe I've got some information on this computer and I want to share it with the other devices or even another computer. And um, the way I can do this is through the network. So if I connect these computers together through a router they will be able to share information. So maybe I've got a document on my laptop, I want to share it with my computer. And I can do that on a network. I could do this through cable, so it would be a wired network, or if this was a wireless router, we'd be able to send the signal to all the devices wirelessly. So that's um, basically how networks work very simply. So desktop computers, laptops, and other devices use networks to share information. These networks can be wired or wireless, and there are three main types of network in use. So the first one is local area network. And normally you find a local area, area network inside one building, so normally a house. So inside your home you might have um, a desktop PC, a laptop, maybe some of your games consoles are connected to the same network. You're on a local area network, you're on a LAN. If um, you had a, your house was connected to perhaps an office, or a university or some other buildings that were less than 30 miles away, generally that's the rule, then you would be using a metropolitan area network. So maybe you've got a computer in your home and your office isn't that far away, maybe it's only 5-10 miles away and you've got a computer there. You're, you could use the same network to share information. And the biggest type of network is actually um, a wide area network. And the internet is an example of a wide area network. So um, this is any, any computers that are on a network that's over 30 miles is usually a wide area network. So if you think about how we use networks, maybe if you're at home, you've got your work at home, and in school, you've got your work in school, we can use um, the internet to go between the two to get some work. So maybe think about how, how might businesses use these types of networks. How do people use these networks you know, to transfer information, to share information? So that's just a very brief guide on the ways that computers can share information using networking.